Have you ever worked on a file in Photoshop and then it crashes and then when you reopen it back again it just doesn't load? Or it actually tries to load it but because the file was so big it just gives you the spinning wheel of death? So let's figure out how to ask Photoshop not to load our previous files. So if we press Command Alt Escape we will get our force quit applications and you'll see that Photoshop is most likely not responding. And if you press command space and to type in activity monitor, uh, you'll get this piece over here where it says Photoshop and you'll be able to see how much CPU it is using. So let's go ahead and force quit this application for now. And then we would need to go to uh, the following location. So you go to your user, your libraries, application support, Adobe, Adobe Photoshop, Auto Recover. And you'll find a list of files here. You will be able to delete the ones that you think are causing the crash. Most likely it is the biggest file. You might only have one, you might have a few. There are a few ways to get to this folder. One of them is if you go to Go, press Alt, and that is going to uh, reveal a new file, uh, a library, and then from there on you can navigate. And as you can see here, we have this file. At this point, you can either move it to your desktop if you think the file is valuable, or you can just simply delete it. The other way of getting to the same folder is if you go to your main My Mac location, from there, select your main hard drive. Here you can choose users, then your user, and here you must select libraries, but the folder is hidden. So if you press Command and Shift and Dot, this is going to reveal the hidden files. From here you can go to library, at this point I'll press command shift dot again to hide the uh, hidden folders. And then from here we can navigate to the same location which is application support, then Adobe, then Adobe Photoshop 2020, here it is all to recover. And you can see the two files are the same. Once we go ahead and delete this file, we can open up Photoshop. and it loads normally.